snap legislative elections were held in Israel on September 17, 2019 to elect the 120 members of the 22nd Knesset. Following the prior elections in April, incumbent Prime Minister Benjamin Netanyahu failed to form a governing coalition, the first such failure in Israeli history. On May 30, the Knesset voted to dissolve itself and trigger new elections, in order to prevent Blue and White Party leader Benny Gantz from being appointed Prime Minister-designate. This election was the first time that the Knesset voted to dissolve itself before a government had been formed. Background Further information, 34th Government of Israel, April 2019 Israeli Legislative Election, and List of Members of the 21st Knesset Following the April 2019 elections, Likud leader and incumbent Prime Minister Benjamin Netanyahu had until the end of May 29 to form a governing coalition, including a two-week extension granted by President Reuven Rivlin. Though the deadline passed without a coalition being formed and Rivlin would have been tasked with appointing a new Prime Minister-designate, presumed to be Blue and White Party head Benny Gantz, Netanyahu successfully pushed to dissolve the Knesset to avoid this. Negotiations between Netanyahu and a number of potential coalition partners stalled. One sticking point between Netanyahu and Yisrael Bitenu leader Avigdor Lieberman was the passage of the draft law, which is opposed by the Herdi parties in the coalition. The law would remove the current exemption of yeshiva students from conscription. Netanyahu needed both Yisrael Bitenu and the Herdi parties in his coalition in order to have enough seats to form a majority. As an alternative, Netanyahu approached Labour about the possibility of their support, but they rejected the offer. Meanwhile, Netanyahu's legal troubles overshadowed further possible coalition negotiations, with Blue and White refusing to work with him in the circumstances. The new elections also mean that Netanyahu's proposed immunity law cannot proceed for now. On May 28, the Knesset passed on first reading a bill which would dissolve the Knesset and force a snap election. This move was intended to place additional pressure on coalition partners to reach an agreement in time, as well as to prevent Gantz from being given the opportunity to put together a coalition should the deadline pass. Later that day, the committee approved the bill for second and third reading. Late in the evening on May 29, it was announced that talks had failed. That night, and into the morning of May 30, the Knesset passed second and third readings of the bill to dissolve itself and force a snap election with a vote of 74 in favor to 45 against. The 45 votes against the resolution came from the entire membership of three parties, the Blue and White Alliance, 35 votes, Labour Party, 6 votes, and the Merits Party, 4 votes. All other Knesset members voted for the resolution, with the exception of Roy Folkman, who was absent. The date for the election was set for September 17. Electoral System Further Information, Elections in Israel The 120 seats in the Knesset are elected by closed-list proportional representation in a single nationwide constituency. The electoral threshold for the election is 3.25%. In most cases, this implies a minimum party size of four seats but it is mathematically possible for a party to pass the electoral threshold and have only three seats, since 3.25% of 120 members equals 3.9 members. Surplus Vote Agreements Further information, Dehond Method Two parties can sign an agreement that allows them to compete for leftover seats as though they are running together on the same list. The bader ofer method disproportionately favors larger lists meaning that such an alliance is more likely to receive leftover seats than both of its comprising lists would be individually. If the alliance receives leftover seats, the bader ofer calculation is then applied privately, to determine how the seats are divided among the two allied lists. The following agreements were signed by parties prior to the election. Yamana and Likud Democratic Union and Labour Gesher United Torah Judaism and Shas Blue and White and Yisrael Bitainu Parties For a more comprehensive list, see party lists for the September 2019 Israeli legislative election. See also, List of political parties in Israel. Parliamentary factions The table below lists the parliamentary factions represented in the 21st Knesset. 
Name Ideology Primary Demographic Leader April 2019 Result Votes, Percent Seats Likud National Conservatism National Liberalism Benjamin Netanyahu 26.46% 35-120 Blue and White Big Tent Liberalism Benny Gantz, Yair Lapid 26.13% 35-120 Shas Religious Conservatism Populism Sephardi and Mizrahi Herdim Ariad Uri 5.99% 8-120 United Torah Judaism Religious Conservatism Ashkenazi Herdim Yaakov Litzman 5.78% 8-120 Hadish Ta'al Communism Arab Nationalism Israeli Arabs Ayman Oday 4.49% 6-120 Labor Social Democracy Avi Gabe 4.43% 6-120 Yisrael Bitainu Nationalism Secularism Russian Speakers Avigdor Lieberman 4.01% 5-120 Union of the Right-Wing Parties Religious Zionism Religious Conservatism Modern Orthodox and Chartal Jews Rafi Peretz 3.70% 5-120 Meretz Social Democracy Secularism Tamar Zandberg 3.63% 4-120 Kulanu Economic Egalitarianism Moshe Kalan 3.54% 4 120 R.A.M. Ballad Islamism Arab Nationalism Israeli Arabs Mansar Abbas 3.33% 4 120 Contesting Parties The Likud, Election Symbol. MW Parser Output. Script Hebrew. MW Parser Output. Script Hebrew was tied with blue and white for the largest political party in the 21st Neset, with 35 of the 120 seats. It is the party of Israel's current Prime Minister, Benjamin Netanyahu, who is seeking to gain more power to build a government after failing to do so following the April election. Prior to the September election, the Likud and Kulanua parties announced on May 29 their intention to run together in the new election. Kulanu officially dissolved itself and its remaining members joined the Likud on July 31, bringing Likud's Neset representation up to 39 seats. The blue and white, election symbol, alliance was created ahead of the April 2019 election and ended up being tied with Likud for the largest political party in the 21st Neset, with 35 seats. Despite suggestions that the alliance should make changes due to their failure to achieve a majority in the April election, the alliance confirmed on June 2, 2019 that it will keep the same rotating premiership of Benny Gantz and Yair Lapid as in the previous election. The party decided to run with the almost exact same list as they did in the April elections. Blue and White has ruled out sitting with Benjamin Netanyahu, due to the corruption investigations against him, however, it has not ruled out creating a national unity government with Likud if it replaced Netanyahu. The joint list election symbol, alliance, which was dissolved ahead of the April 2019 elections, was reformed ahead of the September 2019 elections. It is made up of four ideologically diverse Arab-Israeli parties, who together had ten seats in the 21st Neset. The RAM, Hadish, and Ta'al factions announced on July 27 that the alliance would be re-established, Ballad decided to join the next day. The list is led by Hadish chairman Ayman Oday, who also led the alliance in the 2015 election. Oday said that he is open to cooperation with Blue and White, but would not join their coalition. Shas, election symbol, was the third largest political party in the 21st Neset, with eight seats. 
Shas is led by Minister of Interior Arya Duri. Shas is a Mizrahi and Sephardi Herdi party, primarily concerned with rights and funding for those demographics. Shas declared early on that it was going to support Benjamin Netanyahu for Prime Minister, and ruled out sitting with Blue and White, due to disagreements with Blue and White leader Yair Lapid. United Torah Judaism, UTJ, election symbol, was the fourth largest political alliance in the 21st Neset, with eight seats. UTJ is an alliance of two Ashkenazi Herdi parties, Agudat Yisrael and Agul Hatora, and is mainly concerned with preserving funding and rights for their sector of the population. UTJ is led by Deputy Minister of Health Yaakov Litzman. Much like its Mizrahi counterpart Shas, UTJ declared early on that it was going to support Benjamin Netanyahu for Prime Minister, and ruled out sitting with Blue and White, due to disagreements with Blue and White leader Yair Lapid. The Labour Gesher, election symbol, alliance includes the Labour Party, which was the sixth largest party in the 21st Neset with six seats, and Gesher, a party led by Orly Levia Bekassis which did not pass the electoral threshold in the April election. Due to its collapse in the April election, Labour held its leadership primary on July 2, which was won by Amir Peretz. Following his victory, Peretz rejected merging into a greater leftist bloc and declared that he wanted to bring in new crowds to the party, and it was announced on July 18, 2019 that Labour and Gesher will run on a joint list, with seven seats on the list reserved for Labour and three for Gesher. Yisrael Bitainu, election symbol, was the seventh largest party in the 21st Neset, with five seats. The party has been led since its founding by Avigdor Lieberman, and it is running with the same list it presented in the April election. Lieberman sparked the repeat election by refusing to join Netanyahu's coalition, citing differences with the Herdi parties over drafting Herdi into the military. Due to his opposition to Netanyahu's Herdi coalition partners, Lieberman has declared that he will only support a unity government between Likud and Blue and Amp, White. Yamana, election symbol, is an alliance of several religious Zionist parties headed by Eilat Shaked. It is made up of the Union of the Right Wing Parties, which was the eighth largest party in the Neset with five seats, and the New Right, which did not pass the electoral threshold. After long winded negotiations between the two factions, URWP leader Rafi Peretz agreed on July 28 to give Eilat Shaked the number one spot on the United Right list. The next day, an agreement between the Union of the Right-Wing Parties and the New Right was announced. The two parties of the URWP, National Union Tikuma and the Jewish Home, both voted on and approved the run with the New Right on July 31. Part of the deal stipulated that the list would support Benjamin Netanyahu for the position of Prime Minister, despite resistance to this from the New Right. The Democratic Union, election symbol, alliance includes several left-wing parties, who decided to run together in the September elections. The alliance was announced on July 25, 2019 and is led by Nitzan Horowitz. It will be made up of Meretz, the ninth largest party in the 21st Neset with four seats, the new Israel Democratic Party formed by former Prime Minister Ehud Barak, Israeli Labour Party defector Staff Shaffer, and the extra-parliamentary Green Movement. The alliance declared that it would not sit with Netanyahu under any circumstances. Atzma Yehudit, election symbol, was part of the union of the right-wing parties in the April elections, but left after accusing the other parties in the alliance of not upholding their part of the deal. Atzma is led by Edamar Bengvar. The United Right, which later renamed itself Yamana, attempted to convince Atzma Yehudit to re-enter their alliance, but Atzma declined their offer calling it insulting. Atzma Yehudit initially signed a deal with Nome, but ran independently following a split between itself and Nome. Withdrawn Parties Zahut, election symbol, was the 13th largest party in the April election, receiving 2.74% of the vote and not passing the electoral threshold. Zahut is led by Moshe Faglin. The party was initially interested in running in a joint list with the new right, but was rejected when the New Right decided to run with the URWP instead. Following this, Zahut decided that it would run alone. On August 29, 2019, 
Zahut leader Moshe Faglan announced an agreement with Prime Minister Netanyahu had been reached and that Zahut would withdraw from the election in return for Faglan serving as a minister in the next government, and the promise that Likud will implement some of Zahut's economic and cannabis reforms. Tamar Zandberg of the Democratic Union stated that her party plans to appeal the deal to the Central Elections Committee, on the grounds that the deal might constitute election bribery under Israeli law. The deal was approved in a referendum by 77% of Zahut Party members on September 1st. Nome, election symbol, is a new religious Zionist party which was announced on July 12, 2019, which will be backed by Rabbis Vithal of the Har Hammer Yeshiva and led by Rabbi Dror Ariat. The party announced on July 28 that it had agreed to a joint run with Itzma Yehudit, which Itzma approved the next day though they split on August 1 because Noam did not agree with Itzma including a secular Jewish candidate on the combined list. Following the failed deal with Itzma, Noam decided to run alone. The party launched a signature campaign on August 27, but dropped out of the race on September 15. Opinion Polls Main Article, Opinion Polling for the September 2019 Israeli Legislative Election these graphs show the polling trends from the time Knesset dissolved until the election day. No polls may be published from the end of Friday before the election until the polling station's closing on election day at 2200 hours. If more than one poll was conducted on the same day, the graphs show the average of the polls for that date. At Media All End, Max with 720px, .mw parser output .mw graph img. Allegations of misconduct. During election day a number of parties complained to the election committee. Blue and White, Yamana, and the Israeli Labor Party complained that a number of polling stations had fake slips for their parties. Due to multiple claims of voting slip vandalism, the Central Elections Committee instructed election officials to count the slip as long as the letters were right and if the slip was vandalized with the sole purpose of invalidating it. The official election committee published a notice regarding people who were impersonating committee officials in Kfar Qasam. Numerous parties criticized Shas and Likud for giving out gifts at polling stations. Facebook suspended a chatbot on Netanyahu's Facebook account for 24 hours on September 12 for hate speech, after it said that a dangerous left-wing government, would rely on Arab leaders who want to destroy us all women, children and men and enable a nuclear Iran that would wipe us out, Netanyahu remarked that he didn't write the statement, blamed a campaign staffer for the wording, and that the problem with the bot was immediately fixed. Results Party Votes Seats Plus Slash Likud Blue and White Joint List Yisrael Bitainu Shas. United Torah Judaism. Yamana. Labor Gesher. Democratic Union. Atzma Yehudit. Our Rights in Our Vote. Pirate Party of Israel. Da'am Green Economy One Nation. Human Dignity. Bible Block. Tzemet. Economic Power. New. Justice. New. Comma. New. Liberal Christian Movement. New. Social Leadership. Progressive Liberal Democratic Party. New. New Order. New. North. New. Popular Unity. New. Red and White. New. Respect and Equality. New. Secular Right. New. Invalid Slash Blank Votes. 24,000. Total. 100. 120. Registered voters slash turnout. 6,394,030. 69.4. Source, CEC. Even though Zahut had dropped out some polling places still had their slips. Zahut received 18 votes. See also. Israel Portal. Politics Portal 2019 in Israel List of elections in 2019 35th Government of Israel